I just got uh, one thing. Uh, First sergeant put out a, uh, a arrest warrant, and uh, Bellman signed on it. Uh, it's gonna be uh, thirty-four seventy-five. Take a look at it. They're wanting connection. User with joined the, your channel. Uh, robbery of the jewelry store in the city. Ooh, Unknown point. where they are currently. They kind of like feared. There is a possibility that it could be a uh, an alias too. We're not too sure with our investigation. You just but say thirty four. We're going off of what the rental car agency had for a name, so. Wait, did you just say 3475, Jay? 3475, yes. That war I'm sure that warrant is active, but it's... Shouldn't Excuse me. A, uh, I think that's already a, been executed. Uh, arrest warrant. <clears throat> I need to clear it I with him. I hear in my notes, at least. I need to clear it with Briggs, but I'm pretty sure that warrant should be inactive. I mean, I don't know. He put it out there, so. All right, I'll text him later and uh, just see if what the case is. Yeah, he was uh, assisting me with some of my cases. Okay. Um. <sighs> also, uh. If I can uh, talk with you later, uh, Director. Yeah, sure thing. Alright, uh, don't get shot, don't get stabbed. Uh, Corporal, you got anything? Nope. With the weather, um, air shoes going to be unlimited availability. Yeah, we don't need you getting hit by lightning again. Meh, it caused minor damage. Um, staff sa sausage sa sergeant. You're right over there. <laughs> he lets intrusive thoughts win. I know, right? God damn. I, no, I... I'll be, I'll be out, but I'll be able to respond out to anything should you guys need me for anything. But I'm going to be running some things with SRTB shift for the first few minutes anyway. Director. Um, no, nothing too much. I've heard about, um, you apparently got admitted to OMC a while ago, Frost. Mm, yep. Okay. Are you all good with your return to duty? Yep. Okay. Um, <clears throat> yeah, no, other than that, guys, um, I've heard about there was a crane dock. Or crane dock handler pursuit or something like that. Um, so good work on that. You guys have obviously done quite a bit of work since I've been gone. Um, but uh, yeah, I'll swing back in. I'll be swinging back into it as well. So yeah, um, if there are anything else or any current events that you think might need my attention, just feel free to either shoot me a text message or an email or anything like that, and I'll look into them. Sounds like a plan. I did email oh. you. Um. Okay, this is gonna sound really weird, but just roll with it for me, please. Last shift, myself, Captain Hamilton, Corporal Azrael was on shift. Um, we got a call about someone breaking into a house at thirty fifty one. I believe it was. Okay. Uh, yeah. so the residents of uh, the property owned by Garrett Mason and Garrett Carlson. Um, turns out he's just a friend. His name is Mr. Larkus. Am I correct in saying that, Corporal? Marcus Larkus. Yeah. Really? He was asked by Mr. Mason to go in and get something due to Mr. Carlson being missing. They didn't After file that. a police report, so we never knew about it. Apparently he was missing for quite a while. We did not know about it because they didn't report it. They were going off of what their own thing and their own 
superhero vigilante mission to find him. Anyway. Well, no, because um, he doesn't want anything to do with Leo because he doesn't like us. But we got another call about someone looking like an alien on the island in between 3050, no, 3032 and Stab City. Uh, we all responded out that way. Uh, we got there. We eventually found him. Well, saw him from the main shoreline on the little island. Uh, I went back to grab a off-road vehicle. Because I thought if the tide was out enough that we could probably try and cross at a shallow end. Captain Hamilton had to uh, unfortunately go 10-7. So me and the corporal finished it. We ended up just getting a helicopter going over there. Turns out he's been, he was missing for the past six days prior to us finding him. Um, he was pretty malnourished, had a bump to his head, showed, showed signs of concussion. He was chained to a rock with his hands tied behind his back as well. As well as attached to that chain was a bag full of drugs. We don't know who it was, I tried to observe anyone who might have been uh, observing us rescue him. Not sure. He claims he was walking home from work one day. Uh, car pulled up. He got thrown in their trunk. Went to some warehouse or some other place. Went back to a residential building of some sort. And then ended up on the island. He is currently... Uh, I believe your attack meds. Uh, I believe the attack meds transported him in Eagle Four to OMC. Yeah, OMC. So that, that's well, another actually, thing that we'll. Did him to Sandy actually. Oh okay. Well, they probably they probably would have transported him because of how malnourished he was. He was. He looked pretty malnourished to me anyway. So obvious signs of concussion. Didn't know where he was. He knew his name. He knew the. He was, he remembered the last things he was doing, so. But his pupils were reacting pretty odd to Penlight, and uh, he couldn't say for definite details about where he was and all that. So, Mr. Carlson is found. He is so safe either in Sandy Med or Oceanside Med. Right, okay, nice. Was it Mr. Carlton? Carlson. Carlson. Carlson? R. Car. Carl. Let me look my notes. Yeah, search up. Um, the... Carlson. Yeah, should be Carlson. Is okay. it Carlson? Oh, hi, Hamilton. Is it going to oh, be I'm your sorry. investigation or do I have to. Uh... I mean, no, I'll, I'll, so. me, me and me and Corporal will deal with it. Sorry. Alright, All right, cool. He went missing up here, and he was found up here. We, we got it. Don't worry. <laughs> you've got enough no. on your plate, Laura. You, you've got enough of you've got enough shake going on. Yeah. yeah. Just take it easy for the time being, Laura. Because you got how many, how many investigations have you got oh, open yeah, now? Yeah, how many cases uh, are you up to now? No. Let me count. Oh god. Are you still dealing with a bunch of gangs down there as well, or is that just kind of mellowed out? It's Los Santos. There's always gang shit happening. You also have to remember that B shift brings stuff to her as well. Eight. Oh god damn. But. Two of those are connected, so it's really oh. seven. Fair enough. Bloody hell. Right, I'm going to be running proactive task force. Um, I'm trialing a new vehicle with DPS again, guys, as always. So um, just please, like, if you see a VW Golf racing around, that's probably going to be me. All right. No speed in there, sir. No. My collection. No, in all fairness, I've been trying. Relax. I've been putting it through some um, trials on the racetrack first, um, getting it tuned with the DPS workshop, and it seems to be handling like an absolute dream. So we're putting it through some field testing first, and if it proves useful, then uh, yeah, might be seeing more of it. <clears throat> Captain, you got anything? 
Uh, no. I'm in a classic good old 18 Charger today, so. So you won't oh. be hard to miss. Yeah, I switch maybe up. in traffic and get a normal control. All right, I'll uh, I'll see you when you're in the uh, office to say right there. Sure thing, Laura. All right. The wet news. Yeah, right. Right. You guys have a good one. Stay safe. Keep your head on a swivel, guys. Only if you had jeans on. <laughs> yeah, I wish. <laughs> no, these are slightly lighter to uh, run in. <laughs> Alright, stay safe out there, Cuff. I won't. You better had. Alright, Laura, what can I do for you? Hi, I'm uh, worked in a case, and you arrested mm -hmm. the guy that did we think did the shooting. Okay, give me a name. Uh, Jackson Cortez. Jackson Cortez. Okay, the give one me that shot at your area. Oh yes, I think I know who you mean now. You arrested him on like. For charges of uh, attempted murder of a government official or something. Warning, RFO, firearms. Not my intent for them tonight. Yeah, he's got six counts of attempted murder on a government official and one account of felony evasion. Yeah, we we uh we were working uh we I was on a shift one day in the county and uh the lead, uh got dispatched out to a shooting at White uh Yellowjack. All right. Okay. And uh, we have uh, very similar circumstances towards uh, the hat shooting and the shooting in the city with a uh, mask. That's interesting. Oh. So you want me to do some digging? Uh, no, I was just wondering, uh, He's, he's locked up there for a bit, right? Yeah. Or should I'll be. Have to, uh, I have to uh, call uh, Billman's office, see if he can uh, add on. We'll see if I can add on to his uh, charges. Okay. All right, mate. No worries. Well, you might want to call the courts for that. And what charges yeah. are you thinking of adding on as well? Uh, I would have to go back in my notes. Okay. X-ray one four ten. But I know he uh shot up a rebel pretty good. All right. Okay. I just happened to be going through my cases and looked up the name or and. Uh, looked up at the old report and noticed it was the same guy. I'm like, and I thought I emailed you. I might have emailed the courts and never got a reply back. Right, okay. But <clears throat> I, I thought I emailed you. I could be wrong. I don't remember. I don't recall and getting an email TV. from you relating to any shooting, to be honest, Jay. Incoming 911. Oh, hello. There was an RV place doing selling Harley Davidsons.
You might want to, uh, yeah. Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> yeah. Just running through what's, uh, what's going on with this stolen electroglide. See if we can get a name down and a plate for the bike. We should hopefully track this down in no time at all, if it's still in the area. But apparently this was three hours ago and the guy still hasn't been back. That's why I thought to come down here because I was like, well, I'm the only person that's able to yeah. do a Nighthawk to catch this dude, so. Yeah, no, that's fair. That's <clears throat> what they specialize in stolen vehicles. Yeah, right. That's it. Uh... Hello, I'm on the lookout. User joined the Reading Color Dodge Ram. Stolen from 5024, plate is going to be farm boy coming to spell and we'll be playing in the system shortly. Looks like we have another one. Yeah, apparently. but they're there sometimes. Right. Um, I got a stamp by, let me just look over this footage here again. Burly, big female, looks like, maybe blonde hair. She comes up, <laughs> mess with them, looks like she cuts the wires and runs off south. Oh, no, 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 no. Alright, okay. Oh my god. Right, okay, mate. No, 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 relay time. So... Yeah, would you rather... I know right. what kind of bike um, he's looking for. If we have, yeah, I the mean, the radios are really bad up here. I'm, I'm starting to hear what you're talking about. Card. I'll be honest, mate. If push comes to shove, what we'll do is our radios have a point-to-point -point feature in them. So if the repeaters go down, we'll just our radios will connect to the nearest other uh, handheld radio. So. Yeah. And it's one of the fail safes. Matt Black in color. Oh, see if Harley I can get in contact with Sam Combs. Oh, see if they get right some repair teams out here. Mm -hmm. so yeah, absolutely. Right. The red Dodge Ram. Individuals uh, in possession of a stolen firearm. Unknown uh, how many. Large gun case has been left so open on scene. It will somewhat still be protected. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Alright, if we... I'll get that sorted. Yeah. I'll start heading back down towards you guys. Yeah, happy days, mate. <laughs> Alright. Oh shit, sorry Kev. Oh good. Was the uh, uh, Harley Davidson in black and color? Uh, stand by. <sighs> Don't think I asked that actually, give me one sec. If it's got the plate dealer on it, then it, that'll be our guy. 410, 499. Good, 9 Oh my god, people are able to confirm the now. plate. On the Harley. Who has the plate on the Harley? It should be dealer, common spelling. Yeah, that's our guy, Kev. Got the vehicle, I'll go. 410, Charlie 1. I'm gonna have that black and color Harley electric light in here at 5024 with a large gun case with a gun missing. Received, I'll be on right. 199 route to last on one, but it was related to my earlier number one. Received, us.
user joined your channel. Guys, there's a lot I want to say because uh, I've still got so much like on my plate to do, and my head's just like, you know, we've got so much to do, you just don't know where to start, guys. That's literally me at the minute. <laughs> or ten and Charlie one, you're going to be entering on the dirt road and following it back to the horse stalls. Good copy. User disconnected from your channel. Ezreal came down here for the reports of a stolen pickup truck. Once he got it, well, once he got up over here, he right, seen that vehicle, that motorcycle. There is tracks over just to my passenger side of my charger from what seems to be a pickup truck. Right. And this case right here, which from what I'm seeing, it's possibly like a hunting rifle. So. Yeah. All right. Okay. Give me a sec. <clears throat> it's not an electric light, it's a street light. God damn it. This is gonna be great. Yeah, this is gonna be. We're gonna have a sniper on our hands. I'm calling it now. Alright. Hopefully, can't use it. If you know well. how to use it, it's gonna be a rough day for us. Yep, yeah, that's probably. User joined your channel. <clears throat> Dollar one sound come if you can start me. County tow for one recovered stolen motorcycle. Found um, 0024 off of Sonora Road at the left one to Blanco Ranch, please. Yeah, you're gonna have to bear with me, Laura. It's a shame, but... No, I'll be, uh, 7.42. Okay, mate. Not to worry. I'll, uh, call that out for you. Alright. Alright, mate. Appreciate it. <laughs> Charlie 1, no information on me at this time. Be advised, 354 is going to be 7.42 due to radio issues. User left your channel.
<clears throat> this is great. What's up? We got the red ram flipped over. We had frost right. out with it. Uh, okay. Party goers was stating that the individual that was operating the ram got onto a ATV and started heading southbound toward Post 1000. Currently has uh, Corporal Azro out there, and he's leaving Corporal with the ram to take care of that, and Frost is rolling with the shift SRT to Post 1000. I've already notified right. him about the rifle. Right, okay. No worries. <sighs> uh, right, I'm gonna save vests and rifles for the time being. Yep. Alright. So I want to all units on this channel be advised there is now a vest and rifles protocol in place for a stolen sniper rifle uh, currently in play. BCSO units, if you are certified with NVCAT, go ahead and gear up and be on standby. User disconnected from your channel. User left your channel. User joined your channel. User joined your channel. <coughs> Alright, do you need anything else from me here, or...? No, I'm about to go gear up for VK. Okay, mate, no worries. <sighs> We possibly get either a registration plate or a registration sticker for the ATV in question. 410, that's going to be a negative from my side. I'll try to give Frost a call if he's not in radio signal. Copy. 81 radio check. 5 by 5 Solid copy. Be advised, no. Party goers, it's a no, that's a negative from them. Uh, be advised, 499 is currently in the radio dead zone above in Toledo. I'm making, I'm making my way down south along the beach along the highway towards close to 1000 right now. That's received, Frost. 410, did you get a copy on that? 410 copies. I'm going to head up into the Grand Sonora slash Chumash area into the hills and uh, see if I can do an area search for this ATV. Do we know if it's a quad bike or a go-kart um, format? 
gonna be a uh, quad bike. Receive, thank you. User left your channel. User joined your channel. <coughs> User disconnected from your channel. User disconnected from your channel. Hmm. Sam's having issues. User joined your channel. Be advised, I've lost the tracks at Postal 1003. The tracks at the grass. And no more. Well, this golf certainly uh, getting put through his paces. User joined your channel. ATV here. Received. I'm coming on long Calafi, but I've got no sighting with it either at the moment. Charlie hmm? one, I'm going to reduce code one en route to LTD. Actually, one, can I get User a description of the channel. mail that we're looking for, please? <clears throat> 410, I'm currently working on that now. Charlie, one, stand by. I may have description. Give me uh, one second to retrace my memory. be advised uh, the individual we may be looking for is a Jordan Santos uh, he's a male bald black jacket brown beard that's the only information we've been given at this time um, but if you look up Jordan Santos on the database I'm sure we'll get something more descriptive Checking highways and see if I can pick up this uh, four wheeler again. 410, be advised the CCTV is showing it's gonna be a whiskey mic, vault, black jacket, black and white ATV. I came up, pumped gas up to $15 and zoomed up the mountain. That's received. He's probably heading back to Polito then. Just, uh, Charlie 1481, if you're on this channel, can we just monitor Polito's repeater again, please? Because he might be going for that if this is the guy that's taken them out before. 410, I'm showing 479 is going to be up in Polito. I'm not sure if he has radio signal. Uh, 479, you're on channel receiving. Stand by, I've got, uh, 
as here and I think it's Frost. Hi. What's hey, up, Frost? Cooper? Frost, did you just copy my radio traffic? Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, this guy we're after, he might be heading back up for that repeater, so if you two could head up to there, please. I'm going to scout Polito in general. Do you want me to get a whirly bird up? Yes, good. Yeah, good shout, Az. Charlie 1, 2, all units be advised, 499 is going to go ahead and activate Eagle. Well, I'm going to run the airfield activation of Eagle 2. Ah, oh, the speedo's not animated. 410, I have a possible bullet hole in my back windshield. Here at the LTD at 2006, I'm on standby inside the LTD. The other one's diverting. 81 times. Uh, 81, you've got the off road, or if you can start, if you can go. Uh, Code one, start heading up the mountain, but obviously do it with a bit of haste, please. Charlie, Charlie one to four ten. Keep your cover inside the LTD. We're gonna, I'm gonna start scouring the area as well. Four ten copies. I did not hear a gunshot, so I'm kind of iffy about it. So I'm just on standby with my rifle. Well, I'm not able to outstand the field. Eagle 2, straight to the south face of Chiliad, please. Oops, managed to load out. So just let me know once you're in the area, please. Uh, Actually, well, one, can I get a position on where 410's car is? That way I can possibly judge where the shooter might be. Great seed, LTD. Two is overhead in the south place, so I'm chilling out. Received. Charlie 1-4-10, I'm passing you now. Um, whereabouts are you in the LTD? I want to be in the main shopping area. I have the employees in the management office. 481, my charger is going to be facing toward the Alamo Sea. The shot's coming from my back windshield, so it's going to be like the northeast, the east side of the... Uh, Copy that, thank you. Apologies for us, I didn't get the full uh, transmission when you asked it. Hey, firm had a feeling that was the case. One time radio check. Coming in five by five. We're safe, thank you. Charlie 1, be advised, I'm uh, kind of just doing a couple of drive pies of the LTD, just looking over at Chiliad. I'm not seeing anything in the immediate vicinity. 410 and Charlie 1, if you'd like to take a look behind my charger and just kind of 
confirm if there is a bullet hole in my back windshield, that would be highly appreciated. Let's just say, stand by. me your rear windscreen is entirely missing so I'd confirm that there is at least some sort of damage to the rear of your vehicle. 14 copies I will continue hanging out inside the LTD. <laughs> Charlie One do you um do you know when the shot was made on your vehicle at all Hamilton? That's going to be a negative. I was inside speaking with the employees, walked back out to my vehicle to drive off, and that's when I noticed a gunshot. Copy. If there haven't been any further active shots, I'd say we can uh, go ahead and resume here. Yeah, Charlie One, you've got two bullet holes to the C pillar and also just to the rear, higher side of your rear wheel. I'm going to be entering the LTD. Hey, oh, mate. Yep. Right. Well, I just rewinded the CCTV and you <coughs> to it. Say again, sorry. I just rewinded the CCTV and you beat me to it. Oh, okay. When I'm after scouring the entire area around here with my scope and uh, thermal setting on and I'm not finding anything. If you can relay with tape found anything. You can confirm with that carry on that no one else up here besides them. That's received. Um, 481, if you want to withdraw from Chiliad, please do so. Eagle 2, if I can ask you to do a full sweep of Chiliad northeast south and west both lower me middle and also higher uh layers of it please if you don't get anything from there um you'll be clear to rtb sandy shores uh, well, you can Walter on 10 for on tonight, I might need to do a negative. Sam, if I could have you around the Polito and Grapeseed area, and also uh, Calafi on Route 68, mate, just do a general perimeter check, please. Um, you're going to be looking out for an ATV uh, quad bike. I believe it's white in colour now. We've had a couple of ATV thefts in the area from a Jordan Santos, we believe, who has been uh, causing criminal damage to radio towers in the area. <clears throat> X-ray 1, just a reminder, Polito Bay is a radio dead zone unless you are sitting next to the fire station. Charlie 1-2, 121, you copy. Yeah, receive request permission for plain clothes motor unit due to the situation. <laughs> yeah, go ahead, sir. Received. <laughs> oh, that out his ass. Check. The tower on that border and on top of that, they have been touched. Not that I'm aware of. And <laughs> so I'll go check in there now. Received. Uh, four seven nine. Did you, re you did you just uh, copy all traffic that we've just passed? I've been catching up on my over. That's received. Be advised. Um, if you can meet me at Sandy So, please. Charlie one. I'll be code two to Sandy So.
<coughs> Charlie, one, two, one, twenty-one, just be advised as well for information only. There is a vest and rifles protocol in effect. Um, whether you have your rifle slung or attached to the motorcycle is up to you. Received. I may take the ATV in that case to allow me to take the rifle. Good copy. How the hell did you get here so quick? What'd you say? How the hell did you get here so quick? Oh, don't worry about it. I already had a <laughs> long conversation with the driver of fleet maintenance. <laughs> okay. Dude went like 180. Fair enough. Alright, I think we're waiting on the uh, Hudson, so... Yep. I'm currently trying to find the keys for the CVPI because the voices in my head is demanding a CVPI. Wow, okay. That's just rude. What do we think? That or the dirt bike? Or one of the other bikes? I'll be real with you, if it's an ATV that's on the loose, mate, um, I would go with one of the dirt bikes. Also, um, at least have a plain vest on as well, Sam. There should be some yeah, in the that's, armory. That's, that's the other question I was about to ask. Do we have like a proper or just just any? Uh, I think we do have Server a plain group vest, but assigned. It's a little bit, it's a little bit uh, messy, so to speak. But there should be some plain vests, like for if you're talking about like plate carriers or tank vests. Yeah, okay, hold on. I just don't know um, which ones they are, to be honest. Server group assigned. Uh, da, 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 oh, right. da, I'm getting server groups assigned to me left, right, and center. Let's know which ones are okay. <clears throat> so. Yeah, I don't mind <clears throat> having something, I just don't want it. Yeah. Bright ass colours with keep. wording on the front. Yeah, yeah, keep going, keep going. <laughs> right, hang on. No, 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 go back. Um, hang on, Sam, go back. Yeah, that one, that CID one. And then change the texture on it. That isn't a. Now, oh, okay, there should be one like that, though. I can't find the keys to the Crown Vic. Okay. Does this have a blank one? Let's no. find it. Go to ground, yes, but then an orbit to Mount Chiliad and a few nearby other mountains. Cool, try that, that one. No, try that yeah, one. Towers up on top of the mountain. Like, no. Okay. I'm able to see anyone out of the ordinary. I will be out to be Sandy for refuel. Done for. Right, that one. Server group assigned. Uh, that one. Yeah, tr the, yeah, it's janky though. So change the texture on it, and it's janky. <laughs> so yeah. That's slightly too janky for me to do. Yeah, well, the only other option... I mean, there's... User yeah, joined your channel. the only option is that, then. Okay, right. Yeah. Um, I'll Hudson for, with me. I'll go for that. <clears throat> Alright, mate. Um, at this moment in time, we think there might be... Some, some, sort, some, sort, some sort of attack on Blaine County again. They're going for radio towers specifically. We've had, I think, Frost has reported something like three uh, repeaters go down. Incoming oh, hello. Oh, God. Disregard. Eagle 2, I'm right next to Lighthorn 1. God. Oh, God. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, so. At the minute, location, locations of these repeaters. So yeah, um, I know of two repeaters. One was Zancudo and one was Polito, and I think there was a third one. But for, you might need to ask Frost for that. But I know on the Polito one, which Frost went out to, he reported that there had been signs of tampering with it. Zancudo reported the second tower said that a lightning strike had gone it, but I'm not too sure about that at the minute. Plus up security room with full resources from both departments. Yeah, I've already put in a vest and rifles protocol, obviously, just for uh, safety in the time being. I've also said, um, if needs to, if needs must, get in contact with each other via mobile phones to report any sort of um, outage on the radios. 
Yeah, so guys, in relation to the ASL one call, one times individual on top of a white truck. We're Shit, saying another individual trying to punch him. Yeah. That might be it. I'm sorry, I'm going to be active mate, you know, Mike Uniform, 121, I'm going to route towards that area. Got the one, I'll be on route to that latest on one as well. My <clears throat> license plate for the white pickup truck is going to be pulp, common spelling. Hey look, it's the car you'll never get. Wow. Hey look, it's the car you'll never catch up to. Wow. <laughs> My presence does not seem to be deterring the individual from wanting to fight the individual on top of the white truck. The other one on scene. You mother Mike Uniform 2 on in the area. Sweet Jesus. Yeah, Charlie 1, he's, uh, he's de escalated. <coughs> Mate, you want to uh, go and pull your truck to the side? It was be returning to land and airfield for refuel. Give me two secs, mate. I'll go recover that other truck in the middle of the road as well. So, what's happened then? Uh, so Thank I you. Was, I was just coming down the road, and then that that car slammed on its brakes, and then I hit the mm -hmm. back end of it. Okay. All right. Um. And then he got out wanting to fight, so I jumped in the bed and then jumped on the roof. Yeah. Okay. Um, if you... Right, what I'll do real quickly, mate. Um, are you alright if I do a breathalyzer test on you? Uh-huh. Okay, awesome. If you just come this way with me. You got anything on you I need to be aware of? Any weapons or anything like that? Drugs? Nothing like that? No, no, no. Okay. No, no that's fine. Bad. Yes, they are. I hope so. Yeah. Alright, uh, I'm gonna also, quickly... This is a very nice car. Yeah, tell me about it. I might need to steal the keys for it. Yeah, right. I think you already tried it, didn't you? Uh, no, I, I just moved it. I might do that now, though. Oh, yeah, go ahead. Alright, uh, Mr. Pulp, is it? Yes. Okay, have you done a breathalyzer test before? Yes. Okay, cool. So you know basic, you know the basics of it, yeah? Yes. Okay. Right, when I say blow, do me a favour and just uh, blow into this machine as directed, okay? Make sure you keep a firm seal with your lips around the tube. Keep blowing until I tell you to stop, okay? Thank you. <laughs> Not worries, Sam. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, when you're ready. Blow for me. Keep blowing, keep blowing. Alright, stop there. Thank you. Alright, yeah, so you got BAC of zero, so I'm happy with that. My son is, so am I clear to shut down? He's cleared to shut down, Sam. So. Um, yeah, I'm cleared to shut down. Alright, um, what we'll do, um, are you wanting to press charges for the assault? Like, you got to be deactivating. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know, but te technically, he, te technically an assault is more, he's threatened you with, or intimidated you with threat of violence or physical harm, so... <clears throat> We can go down that route if you want, but obviously we'll have to track him down and everything like that, which, you know, is what we're here to do. Um, but in terms of the RTC specifically, I'm happy that that, you know, from what you've said, that that will be left down to an insurance job. 
but the assault we're not too happy about we will obviously try and track him down if we can okay. oh. <coughs> yeah okay <clears throat> uh that's fine what we'll do we'll um oh my yeah. okay then um right we'll seize his vehicle then um is your vehicle still running is it yes okay well seeing as he's scarpered we'll take his vehicle in um you'll be free to go obviously have you got dash cam to your vehicle actually no okay no that's fine i was gonna say insurance might want that but if they don't then what we'll do we'll make a report of the incident um we'll give you that instant report number you can then obviously uh, show it to your insurance tell them that the police have attended the scene <clears throat> and then obviously hopefully it's not going to be too uh there's not going to be too much liability on you okay. all right no worries all right um other than that mr pulp yeah uh, you're free to leave um obviously we'll be in touch if we need any further details okay okay all right no worries you take it easy sir do you have my id uh oh i certainly do hang on And there you go. Thank you. No worries. All right. Um, have a quiet day. <laughs> Thank you. I'm sure I'll try. And... <clears throat> hmm. Four tankers there. I got it. Cheers, That's one. I'll be in route to that. They just not want one once they secure Fort Ten's car. Jello one two one twenty one. If you can also attend that, please. I'll save my gun if I want to. I'm right. Also, I should be in route country. Why is my camera not working? What's the time? Hello. Right, the the on the dirt across the way from the guy. Just making a record of the number plate. Oh man, do you want me to go back up that? No, one call seems very suspicious to me. Okay, Eagle's pulled up, I'll let you know if we need you. Yeah, stand. Okay. Sorry, I was just uh, stand by at uh, Sandy Airfield, we'll let you know if you need to lift or not. <coughs> Shot the one, I'll be on route this 9 1 as well. Shot one, who's going in from Stab City End and who's going in from the Grape Seed End? Also, I've got myself an A1 coming in through Stab City right now. Copy, I'll take Grape Seed. one if you can lift please let's do an area search i'm not getting anything on the uh east end so far you two get an airborne outbound and the airfield scene
Charlie won't be advised. I'm going to be in attendance, I believe. It's going to be Statewide Towing who's also in attendance. We've got a diesel tanker that's gone over the guardrails. Um, nearest post was 1089. We are going to be approximately uh, 100 meters west of the fishing, uh, the fishing yard. <coughs> Mike, in a full motel, 10 turn 3. Yeah, yeah, you fucking people would drive real police cars. Or turn back to me. Yeah, something like that. What you got for us? Uh, X-ray, 1410. Really? Send well, it. I see that. Is there anything, is there any reason why... Can I get you to... Well, here's bring... the deal. Here's the deal. So, uh -huh. four, obviously I was called out here. Big truck. Turn for and gotcha. the very yeah, simple like winch out is what I was told. Uh -huh. And uh -huh. that was by the, the company, um, some somewhere trucking. And right. when I get here, there's no driver around. I've got this truck that's halfway in a ditch and a tanker on it. Wait, so the driver's right. missing? From the yeah, the driver's gone. Like, the, I, I, I can't find him nowhere. Trailer. Right, okay. Charlie One, sorry to interject. Just for information for all units on the scene, the driver's currently missing from this tanker. So can we just uh, see if we can do a quick area search around the area and try and locate anyone that appears to be injured? 81, <coughs> confirm what Eagle 2 was saying. There is a second tanker yeah, down. Yeah, we straight up got the call for a simple witch out, and I show up here. Give me one sec, sorry. Also, on Eagle, go ahead and check now. Wide area I'm being on the told hilltop. Get a sec second I'll get units down here. I'm well, to go down apparently. to the uh, sea area and have a look. A sec? Yeah, what? yeah give me a sec. New cop is out looking for a rabbit. Charlie 1, can we confirm where oh, the second tanker me. is, please? It's going to be directly down this crevice here. It's going to be at 3 o'clock to this trailer. Oh! Maybe about 50 yards shit, down. Shit, shit. Yeah, Holy shit, shit shingles. Oh, careful, don't fall. Yeah, that was close. 410 again, I'm off in with the uh, accident. Would you guys like squeaker for or a uh, kind of reconstruction truck? Possibly combination. Actually, one, I'm going to need squeaker yeah. for as of, at the moment because I'm going to need the witch Holy line shit, to my assist just got with a white uh, yeah. In fact, actually, hang on. I'll get, I'll get technical one. Try the one eagle two. If you, I can keep you up in the air for search and rescue, please. Uh, 410's getting axed to reconstruction. Uh, 479, are you in? Uh, sorry. 410's getting squeaker 4. 479, if uh, you could get the reconstruction truck, please. I'm also going to get technical 1 here as well due to the recovery. Bloody hell, that was a mouthful. Mm -hmm. Sam, just do me a favour and just stay on scene for the time being, mate. Manage the scene as best you can. Yeah, buddy. Thank you.
One squeaker four, what's your ETA? Oh no, I'm about to be there though. Cabin. Charlie one on 23 op support, going to start technical one now. Doing a lot to the island with sea in case the driver's gone in the water.
heels to advise, I got a nice time within the water. Can I get you to land to where uh, you see the open area on the opposite side of the tanker? Yeah, I'm trying to keep the road open whilst we can. I don't know if you are happy here or if you want to just try and get in that bit of dirt there. Um, I don't know if you would, but it's up to you. Yeah, I'll, we'll keep it flying for now. I'll keep, uh, I'll pull technical one a little bit further in and then, yeah. Yeah, no, that's what I was on about. There's a, there's a gap between the rock and the guardrail there if you want to try and squeeze in. Nah, I'll just do it here, mate. It's alright. Okay. Okay then. Guy drives a golf ball but can't drive a truck. I see how it is. Eagle two, we're just gonna do it from here. You can tell him that he's up. I will. Yeah, I will. Yeah. Man. Drives a damn golf ball but can't drive a truck. Taking yeah. out light poles. I don't know if we're gonna need that one right now. Guys, I'm gonna shoot I mean, it was kind of lighting up the area. Well, now we are. In fact, actually, that's a point. <laughs> He's gonna get turn all of his lights on now. He said that. Four ten eagle two. If you can't land, you have a crew member drop a hoist down, and I'll hoist myself. Then don't worry about C located right now. I believe I'm gonna be currently right under you. Are you at the lamppost? There you go. 
Uh, Thoughts your idea here? Right, I'm gonna. Has Squeaker 4 got a winch? He does. Sweet. If we hook Squeaker 4 and Technical 1, and we'll see if State Wipe get their winch on. We'll see if we can winch this uh, truck out. I, just I mean, check. the statewide guy seemed to think he could tow the whole thing himself. He just didn't want to move it in case we needed it. No, hang on a sec. Yeah, see, that's the thing, right? So we're gonna. Uh, uh, yeah, there's a drop in between the trailer, so we're gonna have to. I reckon if I can get my squeaker five out here to be an anchor for the trailer at the back. That'll be your best bet. So while you guys are focusing on trying to get the cab over, and then I can just use Squeaker Five's winch to help it round the round the bend. Mate, as fucked as it is, I'm almost inclined to see if we can start DPS two. DPS could. I need to find out if that trailer's laden or not. Hang on. You no, know what? what I'll do. I will <laughs> slow shout down here. Once Eagle's done with that, I'll get him to swap out to DPS two. Yeah. Well. Right. Hey, do you know if that Eagle trailer's trip. loaded? Don't have a clue. Haven't touched nothing. I know that the Here DOT go, needs to do their accident investigation Once before you're I can touch it. Your right. I need Once you DOT to go does their accident investigation, I got this all day long. That's You'll why I got rotated. Alright. Because we might be possibly getting a helicopter out here that can. Basically, what we're going to okay. see if we can do, disconnect or the transit unit from the trailer, and our helicopter unit lifts it, potentially. I mean, unless you're able to you winch the um, trailer yourself, like because... Too. In fact, if you come here, walk with me. The issue we've got or ten, is that any other there is a massive vehicle. gap between, the, tr on, as a uh, between the tractor unit and the trailer's axles. So the concern is, that, is if you one, tow this trailer out, you're you going to pull the trailer's going to go down the crevice. No one down there. See what I'm saying? Firm. I'm just checking around the area hmm. right now to see if we able to see So I mean, going injured. off of your experience, what what's your best? What would your best method be? Well, see. <clears throat> I think what I would do, I mean, obviously my 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 job is recovery and towing. I'd set my rotator right there, mm -hmm. and I'd swing my boom out over it, yeah. towards the rear of the trailer here, and I'd bring two straps down, lift up the rear end, while my second truck's winching it, uh, hopefully that way, yeah. away from the rocks towards towards that uh, uh, right side. Yeah. It. He's winching it that way. I rotate my boom slowly with the trailer. Yeah. To hold I mean, it up from falling down in the end of the, the goalie. Is that something you reckon, you reckon you could do? Well, I do got uh, Gervais Towing coming up here. Give me a hand with his big service to it. Okay. What would, yeah, what would those will work with that then? And then if needs be, if uh, things go slightly sideways, we'll get our helicopter to, in as well to assist you guys if needs be. Yeah, no, that's fine. I mean, the only, the only thing I might need some help with is uh, stabilizing on, the little by, truck. Please. Say that again. Say that again, sorry. The only thing I might need a little help with is possibly uh, stabilizing the small wrecker. Uh, as it's winching, which I mean, I can use to raise this truck, and I can use to raise this truck. And, uh, and if anything's got a winch out here, man, winching it that way could be difficult with the with the, the, the angle and stuff. Mm -hmm. What what the only th the, the 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 biggest concern I got? Hey Matt, how you doing? Um, the biggest concern I got is if this tanker slides this way and punctures into it. Like I said, I don't know if it's full or not. I, I haven't got inside the truck or nothing. All right, okay. Um, I mean, going off, of, going off of how it's sitting as well, it's really hard to tell if it would be uh, full or not because the axles aren't going to give much indication on this. <clears throat> not, not at the moment. 
No. Sitting on a tree? Uh, it, Sorry, I got the head off. I'll, be, I'll see you later. Literally shit, nothing, mm -hmm. man. There ain't nothing down. there. Oh, I see. Yep, it's wedged. Good position. Yeah. From down where you are, that you're going to be able to access. So I mean, we got we got two options, man. I, I don't know what you're thinking, but I, I'm thinking my rotator right there. Are you able to see? So I'll blow them out and over it. Grab grab these rear axles and up. The line well, my, the my little wrecker you and your truck so you and whatever other trucks we can get and can winch it that way. Up. Towards the Alamo, they you know, that that away from those two rocks there. Yep. Towards the little hill. Oh yeah, it's good. Or, or option One two, second. they got apparently they got some some heli chopper thing that can pick it up. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We'd, have to uh -huh. we'd have to disconnect the uh, track unit from the trailer if that was the case. Oh. Well, um, you're, well, right, you're on the stuff, just, actually. Just real quick, fine. so we've got men actually working oh, down in the crevice at the moment, so the don't start the hoist just yet, uh, lads. But if you want to get a set off, that's, that's, over. that's uh, yeah, kind of not yeah, reliable, that's fine. Yeah, I can, like, truck flipped around. Right, I'll let you guys Are they down there doing or... I, I saw an accident reconstruction <laughs> truck, I think is what it said. Yeah. Just be a base. Is that what they're doing? We need to check, check something. something. All right. All right, lads. I'll right, let you guys get set up. There, Kevin. Um, but yeah, obviously, just stand by on the hoist first. 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 I need you to confirm whether this trailer is full or not. I'm sorry, what? This should... Alright, we're gonna harness you off the railing. I need you to check the gauges on the trailer to see if there's actually anything in the tanks. Yeah, yep. we're not sure if this trailer's loaded or not. So, uh, seems uh, which hands. one is it? This one or the one that's currently still down there? This one here. This one here. Oh, okay, I got you. Alright, uh, Frost, go ahead and tie off to the guard, guard rail behind us. We're gonna be uh, Kevin's anchor. Is there is there any way we can shut down the whole road? Yeah, we're about to get on that for you now. Just, uh, That'd be sit great. Tight with us. Mm. Yeah, the one that's yeah. down at the bottom. Well, what we're gonna do? Pretty empty. Um, we're gonna ascertain whether the uh, tank has fallen or not first. Um, once we've ascertained that, uh, we'll start getting uh, road shut down for you. I oh, know that's right. Actually, that one that's down there. Mhm. Mm Let me see if I can climb up here. Yeah. I don't know how big. I, is that an empty trailer? Do we know? I'll be honest, I wouldn't have a clue. Uh, uh, I, how how big is that helicopter? A little like, uh, uh, I don't know, EC-130 or what? No, it's much bigger. Um, do you ever see Transformers? Yeah, that helicopter that attacked what? the base on it. Yeah, it's sort of like, it's like one of those. Tra transgenders, of the, uh, what? <laughs> uh, it's like, um, oh, what you call it, Pavlo. So, oh, yeah, big, so, big old some bitch. Yeah, yeah. You, Similar to a you sea think, stallion. You think they could get it down there to pick that up? Because that, that's no just going to be, that's going to be bitch. Yeah, no okay. chance that we'll be able to pick that up because, well, the road to wash alone, let alone the road to span. Uh, yeah. We'd have, we'd have difficulties right. getting that. Yeah, if that one's empty, I'm not going to have any issues picking it up with the tater. I just yeah. got to back it up here, boom, out, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Yeah, as I'm long as you. I got enough cable and chain to make it down there. Yeah, well, hopefully. If not, we'll send two, some lights down and stuff. I got 200 feet per winch. I got three winches on that truck, so. No, that, that works, then. Four if you include the one on the nose. Yeah. All right. I'll see what, uh, I'll see what SO we're doing, and then I'll be back with you. Yeah. Easy direct. Yeah, thank you. He, he's hey, a shield. Yo. Yeah. I need anchoring on the truck for now while it's doing the check. Can you get that side for us? Yeah. Also, right, what's, before we start doing anything, what's the actual, what are you guys doing? Because I'm sort of talking right. with the recovery lads, you're talking with your lads. All right, so what we're going to do real quick, Hamilton's going to go over, he's going to check the gauges on the trailer to see if there's any fuel left on board. Mm -hmm. To do that, I just need the truck anchoring so we know it's not going to roll it. Well, and a little bit of movement. This loose part right, of okay. Here, straighten it out. Um, so you just do, point it downwards right, and we'll we'll keep do, going down. Before we, before we get them Pull onto the truck and harnessed up, then um, let's get it onto the let's get road closed, roads closed, and, and, and then we'll get the recovery lights to harness up to the truck. Hopefully, I don't, oh, I don't need to close the road just yet. 
No, we don't. Yeah, we're not. Because recovery should anchor the truck, mate, so then they can arrange the route, so then they can execute the recovery. Yeah, what I'm saying is, what I'm saying is they're, they're people over there should be able to stay off the road and anchor up for now just to support it while we're doing our part. Yes, but in order for them to anchor it, we're going to need to be in the road. Which is why we need the roads closed, mate. Well, we've got two utility trucks. The keys are still in speaker for if you want to readjust that. Uh, can do. Squeaker four there, but okay. Wait, do you need squeaker four? Not there, squeaker Frost? four. Sorry, squeaker two. Squeaker two. Sorry. Oh. One next to the uh, road out, rotator. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, we'll get a squeaker two as one road closure, and then we'll see if we can use their little truck all the way over there as the uh, other road block as such. I'll just use your utility truck to be fair. <laughs> no, keep that Not being one. Used. Keep, no, keep that one free because we might need a spare winch as such. So. If needed, we'll probably need to this much weight, mate, that's not going to do much. Well, Squeaker well Fall's gonna, in Squeaker combination Fall's got more weight be, behind it. Well, yeah, but what I'm saying is if we get Squeaker 4 and the rotator hooked up to it, the rotator can act as the anchor and then Squeaker's, uh, Squeaker 4 and Tech 1 can act as the essentially pulling it back up if it does start sliding. Right. You get that on the ball and all yeah. sorts of stuff over here. Right. Hey, Hudson, start. Hudson, do me a favour, um, get squeaker two and get it set over there for me. On the road closure. I'm, uh, I'm going to be going for it too anyway. Right, okay, mate. In fact, right, what I'll do, mate. I'll get, um... I'll get as out the helicopter and him over here with squeaker five. Uh... Well, we might we might need DPS too. I'm not sure. I don't. I honestly don't think the helicopter's gonna do as much good here. The rotor wash on itself is gonna force that wagon down the hill. Well, not if it's anchor. That's what I'm saying. If we anchor it first, we should be alright. Right. Yeah. Right. Hey, just yeah. Get a squeaker two in position, mate. I'll get the other one in position. Hey, lads, is that um are the keys still left in your baby truck over yonder? Yeah, Ricky's in there sleeping. All right, I'm going to get that truck moved across and make it uh, use as a roadblock if that's all right with you. I'm going to be using that truck. Oh, what, for the recovery? Uh-huh. Right, okay. All right, no worries. I'll use, we'll use my, the, my, don't, my truck don't then. We, don't we have those uh, cones that you throw down from the air? Uh, so, well, something like that. Either way, we just think more physical barrier would yeah. also be beneficial for you, so... Oh, no, but, yeah, I understand a physical barrier, but there, there's also that um, one that you can put a spotlight in a large area if you get my drift. Yeah, yeah, I'm with you. There you go. Hudson, I'm going to get Tech 1 and uh, use it as a barrier because they're going to be using the baby truck for the uh, part of the recovery. X-ray 1, are we stabilizing the main truck before X-ray 10 goes over and says, check to see if the trailer is full or not? Yes, yes, that's what we're about to do. We're going to get the road closure in place first, then going to anchor the truck. Once we've anchored the truck, we can ascertain the load. So the one traffic controls in place. <clears throat> up there to help lift the back, and then if one of these trucks have winches, put it up over this way. Yeah, this way. one does. And pull the trailer <laughs> this direction. <laughs> So that it doesn't push up against those logs sticking out, so I don't bust it. Mm. Well, I do have a uh, friend. So I saw some odd landing over to the west, west, west of the scene. Not the area. So, and I got snatch plots. Perfect. So we big heavy. Eighty thousand pounders. 
Mm-hmm. I right. never use them. I have them. Well, they'll come in Can handy if you purchase light. if you buy my company. Yeah. Actually, I've been. For now. I got a uh, nice uh, new flatbed on order. Even still hold off frost. I want it anchored properly. I don't want it sliding as soon as Kev gets on there. Right. Um, you lads happy with what your plan is then? I think I think we got an idea and a plan in place. Okay. So what what are we doing then? Well, we're gonna start with Plan A, mm -hmm. and if we make it to Plan M, M M stands for get all the Mexicans here to do it. Give me a sec. I hope so. Mountain lion, mountain lion, mountain lion. All right. Oh. Okay. All right, lads. If you want to yeah. get your trucks, I mean, if you want to get your trucks in position, then um, are you needing this truck as well? Did you say? What? What? Whatever big. Big truck big from the new three can yeah, sit right it. about here, facing the trailer. Yeah, I'm sure Frost can do that. And we'll get some big K-strap uh, trailer straps to yeah. go around that yeah, trailer. If we move out of the way, let Squeaker 4 come in. Ow! <laughs> yeah, that's I believe hurt. I can see. <laughs> a likely story. I can, can't now. Which other one? We're going to be getting uh, trucks in position to start uh, anchoring the truck down. Ju ju just for safety reasons, I I'd rather not have that uh, Dodge there. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. Three two wheel. I'm jumping down. Which other one? Full turn. You able just to move that ram uh, back to where technical was? Technical one was across the road over there for me, please. That is his anchor point for going over to, to check the trailer as well. <sighs> uh, I thought it was the guardrail. It's both to be safe. But if you need to move, if you really do need to move it, you should be able just to detach it from the winch on the front of the ramp. Yeah, Roger, we'll re-anchor him to statewide towing's truck. Sorry, Kev. Hey, mate, we're gonna get mm -hmm, um, we're gonna get ride. one of our operators anchored onto your truck as well. So he's got a secondary anchor from the guardrail as well. All right. <clears throat> Hey! I has the rope. What am I attaching it to? Yeah, pass it here. I'll hook you up to it. Don't pull too hard. I don't like flying over this guardrail. Yeah, hey, uh, shield. Come over a second. One sec. Hey, have you got an anchor point I can uh, secure this fine gentleman to? I'm a unicorn. Sure, right. Oh, here we go. Right. Let me know once your outrigger's set, mate, and I'll uh, hook him up. Yeah, it should be set down. All right, here we go. It's uh, it it it's being uh, worldly. If you get my drift. Yeah. Right. Okay. Right, Kev, you're all anchored up. Give me one sec. Right, mate, I'm just going to remove my. I'm just going to remove my speed thing. I need you to replace it. That's all. Oh, right. Okay. Just want to remove it from your loop. One second. Yeah. Sorry. 
Alright, have fun. Alright, it's okay, mate. Oh, 79, 10, User disconnected from your channel. Did you do that, uh, front to front winch? Uh. You might need to show him, mate. <clears throat> Yeah, no, I got it. Um, uh, yeah. Okay. You, you got to turn on FF winch on there, and then you walk up to that, and you turn it on to that, too. Ah, that's right. Yep. Yep. What way do you need me to go? And I'm going to have you pull it this direction very slightly so that it doesn't go into those uh, wood pillars down there on the other side. This is either going to go really well okay, or but really hard. Do you need me to set guys. up that winch <laughs> setting or no? Yeah, he might need help on setting that up, mate. No, I just need to know which configuration to put it into. Ah, run, run. Uh, it, just a worldly. Uh, one, the other one's not going to work from here. Two, not, your, your oh. winch isn't long enough. So the actual tow rope? Right. That's not going to be long enough either. That's not going to be that long enough. That actually has a that actually has a shorter range than the winch one. Yeah, just to ah, use yes. the worldly mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Hang on. Right. Um, but before we do start winching it, mate, the only other thing I'm going to. Uh, ask is we just keep it anchored while we get our guy to ascertain whether it's under load or not Or whether it has a uh, load. Oh, on yeah, board. no, no uh, Rick Rick is getting those straps from the, the rotator down uh -huh. My truck's already locked up on the winch. I think Gervais has got yep. his and then he's just got to type his out and put it in there Gotcha. Okay. No worries All right And then All we right. just sit and wait till you find out if it's loaded <clears throat> Yeah, once he's stable, we'll, uh, or once the truck's stable, then we'll find out. John, when... was he the doubles? Kev, stand by to mount. Uh, it might have been. And then when you start winching, you gotta turn the page up and turn the page down. Uh, the other one, 481, once you can, uh, just let me know that, uh, the yeah, town companies have got the, uh, trailer winched up. Please. <clears throat> Yo, sir. Yep. Waiting for the green light. Uh, yep, if I go over and you see my left arm go flying above my head, pull me up. Yeah, right, definitely. Because I'm going to kind of need both of my hands, so I kind of just have it wrapped around my arm. Oh, it's yeah, kind of huh? non dominant, so if things go super bad, I'm fine. <laughs> yeah, no, absolutely. Right. Each other 1481 there, uh, tow wolf set. Another one four eight one receiving. Stand by. Tell me that then. God damn it. Extra ten, you're good to climb over it, see if it's full or not. Alright, that's rock and roll. Cool. Daredevil things. Woohoo! Don't you dare move. Stop it. <laughs> careful up there, Kev. No, we're 
Where is it at? Where is it at? Where is it at? There it is. Mm. Yeah, it's looking to be full. Yeah? Alright. Yeah. Alright. Is it all the way full or just partially full? Yeah, it's or? all the way in the green. Oh shit. Alright, okay. Don't want to be advised this tank is going to be fully loaded. <laughs> Alright, mate. X-ray 81, just to confirm, Ooh. it is 100% nice fully loaded. Okay, Got one more, it's in my back, I can't reach it. Yep. I got you. Mr. Swatson, shout over at me when you're ready to start pulling. There you Appreciate it. No worries. <clears throat> Tell one we're all clear from the uh, tanker. They're clear they from it. Just you're get good to pull behind the guard whenever. rail, mate. Ready, nope. Matt? Yeah. Yep, Kevin just gave me a thumbs up, so start pulling. Yikes. Oh, yikes. Oh. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute, Matt. Yep. I think it's stolen my winch out. Mm. Oh, lordy. Hey, do you want me to get a technical one up here? Get a third winch on that? If we, uh, yeah, because I need to, I don't know about them rocks. I want right. to come the other direction, but that didn't work. All right. Might have to let out your winch there, Matt.
All right, boys, when you open your book, you got to go uh, uh, page up the winch. All right. All right. All right. All right, ready when you are. <clears throat> Three, two, one, winching. Hey, turn the page down. I know there's a rock sitting right there, trust me. Right, I'm gonna i I'm gonna loosen off and back up some. Hey, actually this I think I might be able to grab this with the big tater and lift it right off the rocks. unit anchored. Trailer swinging. It, ten nine. The trailer's swinging. Very violently too. Uh, hold what you got, Frost. It's all right on my end. The time being. <coughs> hey, for me, this fish tailing like crazy for me. Ten four, mate. Director. He needs this unhooked? Yeah. Alright. Right, give me one sec, I've got a free spool it again. Just mind yourself, I'm going to try and uh, set a winch up to the trailer here. Uh, where's matey boy gone? Watch yourself! Yeah, are you actually... Oh, okay, you're pulling it out. Oh. I was. Yeah, tell you what, if you want, let me get a winch attached to the trailer, and I'll try and pull the trailer around so we get it off the rocks at least. Alright. Alright, what's, uh, what's the page for the side winch? Uh, uh... Um... would it be? I believe so. Right, I'll give that a shot. Yeah, 
looks like it. Oh, there's two W's for that. Okay. I'm set. Right, I'm winching it. No. Right. No, winch. Nah, the winch snapped. I feel like I've shown right. up at the perfect time. I was like, fuck it, I'm bored, my bum hurts. I'm gonna leave your bird with the B shift guy. Yeah, right. I'm playing Uno. Cheers for that. Right, um, I'll tell you what, mate, you can go ahead and take DPS2 back to Sandy Airfield now. Uh... <laughs> Charlie 1, we're gonna be, uh, truck's gonna be clear of the uh, crevice now. Keep roads closed for the time being, boys. You probably won't be advised you're not going in over radio at all. Alright, hmm. apologies for that. I was on the wrong channel due to the winch controls. Um, let's keep roads closed for the time being. Um, we might see if we can get this other trailer out. Not sure yet. Alright. Right. What we, do we got now? Are we leaving that other trailer down there for another time or Is it is it empty? I mean, it is empty. I mean if it is. It's up to you guys. If you want it left down there, I can get it another day. It don't matter. Yeah, the trailer that's down there on the bottom, it's completely empty. Yeah. Alright, okay. I mean, I, I, I don't have an issue with it staying. We, well, what do we fancy doing? Doing a uh, another tripod? And getting someone down there to hook the winches I'm up? I'm more happy to go back down since I'm already geared up. Yeah. Okay. Frost, are you alright to set a tripod up for Kev, please? Happy days, thank you, mate. All right, um, we'll get you anchored. Yeah, I don't, I don't have a problem either way. I mean, okay. I well, think your best um, right. <coughs> right, hang on. is actually what we'll do first. Pull it from the corner, that back up. Well, yeah. That sure. Looks like it came down that way. Potentially. We'll landing and there. Um, what we'll do we'll just get a squeak. Of Let's get a squeak of four um, anchoring to, uh, Kev again. And then uh, we'll also Connection anchor lost. it to the. Oh, hello. Oh. Well, that's good. Uh, I think that might have been Hightower's uh, server going kaput. Well, guys, uh, unfortunately, that's that. <laughs> um, if the server comes back up, 
I will let you guys know. But uh, yeah, it looks like the server's just gone down, unfortunately. So connected. Oh no! There we go. It was my internet. I don't know why that happened. <laughs> Charlie One Code Zero. Yeah, it was just me. Four ten, Charlie One. That's gonna be a confirmed major Code Zero. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah. All right, guys, let's get ourselves back in this. Roger, I'll be relogging now. Oh no, don't say that. 5M's offline. <laughs> Game just shat itself, or my internet's just shat itself. Oh no, we're back. We're back in it, boys. Let's go! Oh, there, mate. What happened there? I think that may have been the ISP, to be honest. Uh, it's weird because Discord didn't crash, but TeamSpeak and 5M did. might take a while guys <laughs> oh has actually saved it oh it has awesome Charlie one uh, radio check. <sighs> Ten volt, thank you. I just had the weirdest dream. <clears throat> yeah. Alright, someone wanna update me on the plan? We're pulling the other It was all in your dream, control. I promise. <laughs> We're going to uh, hook that trailer up and pull it up here, as well as our plan is. Happy days. Mm. Alright. Kevin, right? Yes, sir. All right, Kevin. John Swanson, nice to meet you. <laughs> so, I've got uh, some chains that I'm going to hand you. Yep. You're going to go around the two axles, one on <coughs> each axle. 
I want the hook set up on the chain so that if the hook breaks off, it shoots away from us. You yep. get what I'm saying? And then I'll have two both winch lines off of here coming down to you. Any questions? Nope. All right. it that way away from the outside. Two axle chains. There you go. Whee. <laughs> All right. Where the hell did you find that guy? You're hooked up to the front of your thing. Oh, thank you. He's gonna hook up to the back, I'd fold it all together. 99, you mind moving out of the way? to one from your okay. You look very dark and broody up here. I'm just being the extra set of eyes. Fancy. Yeah. I had an extra pair of eyes. Mm -hmm. I left him. I left him behind. God damn it! It's not my fault. Your units want to play Uno in the back while I'm just floating around. Yeah, there is that to be fair. You had no idea how tempted I was just to put the fucking thing in autopilot and just join in. Yeah, yeah I wish. <laughs> yeah, I might have to have someone bring up a flatbed as well. Clients put on flatbed. Fuck is he? No, 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 if you feel mirrors. Yeah, right. Yes, sir. Alright. Oh, it's a slow moving winch. I'm just gonna let it do it automatically.
Alright, I think we might be getting somewhere here, I'm not sure yet. Hang on a sec. My arms grow too big, I can't reach my back. <laughs> Tell me, when do you want to go skydiving at Eagle 2 again? Skydiving's fun. <laughs> yeah, sure. It's fun, I was hooked up to everything, so I was able to just jump out and let it catch me. <laughs> That's how we did it in the Marines. Fair enough. At least it didn't, like, catch you in a certain area that would hurt. It oh, won't be the first ouch. time. That's why I got a helmet on. Shit, right? I love helmet. Ooh. <clears throat> oh, I'm going to my hidey spot. Have fun. Hmm. I won't. I've got to navigate the locals. Yeah, let's do me a favor. I'll get some traffic control on uh, the. Eastbound side, please. Not sure what that meant, but... Beep. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do, mate. <clears throat> I got a semi truck coming with a flatbed. I could set this on. No, if you don't. So if you just see a random semi coming through the scene, that's that's what it is. No, I mean, no worries. What the? Well, that is not a semi. That's not a semi. No. What that's a bitch. Yeah, what the hell is going on? Years ago. Person. Where did uh, huh? Swanson go? What is he? He, still he, was a, he just got out of the rotator. That uh, wasn't him. Yes, it was. It was. It was. Yeah. Yeah. He's just dealing with the trailer now. Big awkward looking like black marker. Could be a knife. 
No, it's a bit too it's a bit too much like a chode to be a knife. I don't know, someone could probably use that for a different kind of tool though. Keep walking behind me, I'll end up hitting you. That tent was a good song. Uh, uh, hold on. <laughs> that toilet. No. What is it? I think it's the oh. remains of a light pole. Oh, is that? Oof. It's a big ass light pole. Oh, come on, it looks like a toilet from here. I thought it was a toilet. <laughs> if I'm going insane, that means the captain's insane. No, yeah, I happen to look over and it looked like a toilet. It's not a toilet. I don't know what it is, but it's not a toilet. It's the remains of a light pole. It looks like a toilet. It is a toilet in your imagination. What you got to do is believe. Imagination. And not get caught for indecent exposure. Indecent? Imagination. <laughs> this is going well. Yeah. I got a lot of no one going through my body right now. Is that because you jumped out of my helicopter? Mm, sure. You should. <laughs> There is a there is a perfectly good working, safely lower you down fast rope. Not That's a, weird. I did have I, it on. <laughs> His sleeves messed up. Interesting. Not set up the way you everyone else uses it. You went down very quick. Yeah, they caught me though. <laughs> yeah, and I felt it. Yeah, you be alright. You might not weigh that much, but when you yank on a cable attached to a helicopter. Um, That's the best way to do it. it. And I've made my flight suit have a brown patch at the back. It's fine. Ugh. Gents? Gentlemen, I uh, thank you for your help. And lady. Um, and lady, yes. I'm gonna oh, no, go have... Just shut up. I'm gonna go have Ricky take the tater and get that truck towed out of here with that trailer. I'm gonna take that home and then uh, Lucas Local's gonna take that home. Oh, good old, happy guys. Happy we can and... be of service to you. Hey, anytime, anytime. I'll gladly work with you guys again. Absolutely. I'm going to out another helicopter. I got you. But we'll, we'll see. He might be owning it before long. Well, helicopter? No, my company. I, I mean, uh... I do, I do, I have flown helicopter, yes, but it's been a minute. I got you. Touch you. my helicopters. I swear to God. Sorry, whose helicopters, Grim? Mine. I thought they were shares. Yeah, Ricky, I'll help you. Yeah. I didn't know DPS2 no. was yours, Grim. Huh. No, not yours. Where he did, he jumped out of mine. <clears throat> I jumped out of Eagle, too. Yeah, he jumped out of mine. Yours is just <laughs> weird. That's like a massive spider. Yeah. Well, that tech might one's have got a weird noise to it again. What the hell? Fuck. I'm gonna have to sort that with the mechanics, I swear. Yeah. I don't like DPS2 anyway. DPS3 is cool though. Charlie one all the units. We can start breaking this scene down, please. Oh, no, no, no. I can't look over the cone from the end. Yeah, they might be glued down.
Are you okay there? Yes. <laughs> okay. So the one I'm going to be code for tonight, returning to San Diego. <clears throat> I'm going to scratch that. I'm going to uh, take technical one back to DPS up support. <coughs> Well, <clears throat> there was a lot I wanted to talk to you about today, um, but I think I'm going to, not necessarily call it, but I think I'll put that off for another video. Um, just because, yeah, there was a fair amount to cover. I honestly don't know. I swear to... Stupid bus in front of me. God damn it. <laughs> As forgot he could overtake. <laughs> <laughs>
User disconnected from your channel. <laughs> Incoming 911. I'm still on route back to Ops support. Is anyone else uh, available to take that place? Going. Okay, then. <laughs> 